Well, good morning and happy Never Miss Monday. It looks like everyone's up and recording, which is perfect. So today for Never Miss Monday, we're just gonna do a ladder going down and then back up. We only start with 20 reps of everything, then down to 15, 10, five, and then we work our way back up, 10, 15, and 20. Now if you're following along at home and you feel like you just wanna go down or just up the ladder, that's perfect. In theory, this should take you anywhere between 25 to 45 minutes, depending on condition level and uh, which version of the exercise you do. So with that said, if you find that you're getting down pretty quick, there is a bonus round we can get into at the very end. Um, if it finds out that we all take about 40 minutes to get this done, then we'll probably just skip that for today. So when it comes to the exercises, we start with the chair for that shoulder dip. We got 20 of those. Then we have 20 on each side of a reverse lunge to high knee. So it's gonna be quite quad heavy. For the plank reach, this is a newer one. We're gonna be in that plank position, shoulders over those wrists, core is tight. Opposite hand, opposite foot come up and right back down. The goal is to try and control that up and down motion, pushing through the heel and the opposite palm. Option, take it down onto the knees, pressing it out, and coming back into that plank. Uh, again, that's gonna be 20 on each side. For a trans squat is another newer movement. That's from that neutral point. You take it back at that 45 degree angle, sit down into those hips, stand it up, and then you're gonna change into it. So that's gonna be 20 total there. Uh, wood chops we've done before, 20 on each. Med ball push-ups. You're gonna do a push-up with the med ball in one hand, slide it to the other hand in between those push-ups. That's just gonna be total though. Russian twist, 20 on each side, and then the step ups. Again, I'm gonna use my chair, or if you have something else that you can step up for 20 on each side. That being said, crew, let's go ahead and get ready to have a little bit of fun. We're gonna start off with those 20 shoulder dips and then start working our way down. That clock starts in three, two, one. Let's get moving. So again, for those shoulder dips, hands gonna be on that firm part of the chair, shoulders down back, keeping those hips right along that chair. Get nice and low on the way down, drive it back up. Again, it's almost like your hips are gonna saw on that chair as opposed to scooting away from it. That other option, you can always walk those feet in to decrease that intensity or walk it out to increase. And I think I was counting, but we're gonna find out. Here we go, five more. And four, three, two more. And last one, now we've got those reverse lunges to high knees, 20 on each side. So from here, I sit back and then drive that knee up. You can always add a little bit of a hop if you'd like. That option is up to you, 20 on each leg. Five. Remember, find that balance. Don't let those knees collide inward. When you step it out, make sure those knees stay out. Past the halfway mark. Here we go for 13. Last couple right here. Five, four, three, two, one more. Now we switch it, 20 on that other leg. Again, find that balance on that front leg. Weight stays relatively in those heels. Again, I'm not gonna fall over. I'm gonna have that balance. I don't know why, I already had my coffee today. Should be perfect. Ooh. Last couple right here. Then we're gonna go into that plank reach. That's that newer one. And four, three, two, and one. So plank reach, it's gonna be 20 on each side. Again, we can be up on those toes or down on those knees, off the hand, opposite foot, kick out. The goal is that get that core. Blah. The goal is to get the core nice and active. Try to make sure that you're keeping that rate the same as you press. Again, hands and toes, or hands and knees. Whew. Go back to my knees so I don't fall over. And we're halfway through. Again, pushing through as you go. Trying to balance and talk. It's actually quite challenging and exciting. Okay, we got three more on each side. Here we go, two more. One more each side. Ooh. 
Now we got those trans squats. So from that neutral, just set up at that 45, sit down, stand up, and then switch. You're just going at that 45 degree angle. Think of it as just a little extra work in that squat to play with those hips. Remember this is 20 total. So here goes eight. And then have that med ball ready because we're gonna be going into those wood chops at the end of this. There's 14. Keeping that chest proud. Two more. Here's 19 and 20. Okay, we grab that medicine ball. We get those wood chops going down by that hip, up and over that shoulder, shoulders down back, core tight. Remember 20 on each side. Six. Pivot those heels, get those hips in it. Looking good, crew. Five more, we switch sizes. Three. Four, one more. Now we're gonna switch sides. 20, go in that opposite direction. Again here, maybe feel some of those shoulders. You get that core and those sips in there as well. Now remember we keep this for those med ball push-ups coming up after this. Again, keeping that core active by bringing that belly button in that spine. Through with those hips. Woo. Last five. Here we go for four. Three. We're gonna two. Last one. Now we get those push-ups. 20 total. So I'm gonna start with the ball on one hand, give myself a push-up, roll it on over to switch sides, and do that next side. That option, you can always go down onto your knees as you do the push-up or the pass. Halfway. Fourteen. Sixteen. Four more crews, stay with me. Seventeen. 19 and 20. Ooh, those push ups were fun. Now we're gonna go ahead and get some core with that Russian twist. So shoulder blades down back, spine long, going side to side. That's two and two. Keep it there. Now, if you wanna add some intensity, try to lean back a little further or take those feet up off the ground. If you notice that they're pedaling like a bicycle, that means you're using too much hip flexor. So I would put those heels back down, re-engage that belly button and that spine, and then try to lean back again. Whew. We've got just three more each side. Two, one, and one. Now we have those 20 step ups per leg. So I'm gonna go ahead and drive my foot up there, right back down, switch its sides. That's one. Again, you can always take this to a march in place is another option. Just listen to that body. Whew. Looking solid crew. Keep that drive going. Coming up to that halfway mark. Moving those arms. Looking solid, looking solid crew. Let's keep it up. We're getting almost to the end of these step ups. We got five more each leg. Here we go for four more. Three more. Two more, two more. The last one each leg. Then we're gonna go back to the top with a change up is your rep count. 
now goes down to 15. So if you're jumping ahead of me at home, if it says 15 and it's the right and left, make sure you even it up on both sides. Don't let one side be 14. Then it gets awkward. Okay, shoulders down back, going into my dip. 15 reps here. Looking good. Six, remember play with that depth if you can. Don't let that shoulder come up to your earlobe. 13, 14, and 15. Take it up, reverse lunge to high knee, 15 per side crew. I'm gonna go ahead and cool off real quick. Take that top layer off, drive it up, right back down. Looking good. Now, when you lift that knee, use that core a little bit, but also have that balance. I don't know where I was going there. Looking solid, and just four more. Three, two, the last one. Now I'm gonna go ahead and switch sides, get nice and low, drive it up. Looking solid, crew. Eight, nine, five more. Now next up is gonna be that plank reach. Two and one for that plank reach, knees are toes. Thank you, Shelly. So, plank position. Again, try to do opposite hand, opposite knee, or go down onto those knees. Same thing, feel that core. Stay nice and active. You've got 15 on each side. Again, if you're challenging yourself with hands and toes, still Finding that balance so you don't fall over. Moving the arm and leg, relatively same height and speed. Whew. Three more. Two more. One more. Whew. Okay, now we grab that spot for those trans squats. 15 per side. All right, 15 total, which let's make it even for 16, because why not? Because now we're halfway there. 10, here's 12. Get ready with those wood chops. 14, 15, I'm gonna make it even, 16. Now I got 15 wood chops per side. Shoulder blades down back, pivoting at that hip, walk out that core. and then we do it one more time go in the opposite direction again please make sure you pivot those hips and you should not feel anything in that low back if you do I want you to squeeze your butt cheeks bring that belly button in that spine and throw with those hips it's kind of the opposite of how you chop wood because you chop downward not upward but you get the drift and two and one, now 15 of those push-ups, just 15 total. Again, go side to side with that ball. Three, four, seven, eight, nine. Five more, looking good, crew. One, Two, three, there's four, last one, and five. Booyah, crew. Into those Russian twists. 15 on each side. Keep those shoulder blades pinched. Going side, side. Get that core nice and active. 
Again, you can play with moving those feet if you'd like to. Five more each side. One, here's two, three, four, last ones. On to that step up. We got 15 crew per leg. Down, down. Woo. Here's two. Looking good, find your zone, drive into it. Again, take it to a march. So a step up is not your jam. The last five each leg. There we go. Here's 13. And 13. Looking solid, keep that drive. The last one each leg. Then we go down to 10 reps of everything. Whoo, crew, you are slaying it. 10 of those dips, let's get straight into it. Three, four, five, six, here's seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now we got those reverse lunges, high knees, 10 on each side. Drive it up, so lock out that core, chest stays proud. Six, seven, eight, here's nine, one more, 10. Let's switch it up, drive it back. Whew. Try not to fall over on my uh, foot placement right between some boards. That was a bad idea. There's 10. Now we go into those plank reaches. 10 on each side. Again, choose where you want to be. Keep it slow. That's where you make the change. Okay, you can always be up on toes and hands and just move your hands or your legs instead of both at the same time. Here we go, 10 and 10. Trans squats, 10 total. Sit those hips back, keeping that 45 degree angle. Whew. Here we go, six. We're past the halfway mark. I like 10 reps, it goes by quick. Okay, wood chops, 10 on each side. Again, spin with those hips, lock those shoulders. Six. Bring that belly button in that twine. Nine. One more. Let's switch sides, opposite direction. We got 10 of those push-ups crew. Get nice and low. Remember to shift that ball side to side. Did the ansel die? All right. Six, seven, eight, nine, last one, 10. Whew. Okay crew, let's get back in that Russian twist. 10 on each side. I don't know if you saw that on the camera, that was my cousin Rain. He found out last night the ants had gone through the electrical socket and made a home in his computer. So he has some parts out here that were running out overnight that are the exterior part. Here's 10 and 10. So if you know how to get rid of ants from a computer, hit me up. Drive it up, up, down, down. 10 each leg crew. Well, I like this, I'm getting sweaty. Hopefully that means you guys are too. Or maybe that's just the free rain sweat I got going. Whew. A couple 
couple more each leg. One more each side. Here we go, 10 and 10. Now we go back down into that shoulder dip for just five reps. And you guys are crushing this on time. Two, three, four, five reverse lunges to high knees. Her side, step it back and drive it up. Again, engage that core, chest proud. Four and five, let's switch those legs. Drive it up. Two, three, four, one more. Five plank reaches, five on each side. Shoulders down back. I forgot my leg on that one. Here's two and two. Four, four, five, five. Trans lunges. Let's make it six for an even number. We just like even numbers. That way we go same out both directions. And back in those wood chops. Five on each side. Pivot those hips. Use that core. Whew. Three, four, and five. Let's switch sides. Opposite hip. Two, three, Here's four, one more. Now let's do five of those push-ups. I'm gonna try to even out my sides. Start on the side I don't normally do. Here's three, four, one more, and five. Russian twist per side. Shoulder blades back, core tight. Here's two, three, four, and five step ups per side Ooh, and then crew we can start adding those reps back in so listen to that body make adjustments as we need to especially as we start to get higher in those reps our bodies are going to be like oh goodness five and five back up 10 shoulder dips let's go ahead load it Again, you can always walk those feet in to decrease some of that intensity as you need it. Three. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. One more, one more. Now let's go back, reverse lunge, high knee. Ten on each side, crew. Drive it, squeeze that core. Chest staying proud. Love it, crew. Again, as we start to climb up on this rep count, we're gonna let you know we're at 20 minutes. Let's go ahead and switch legs. So, if you're following along at home, you need that break, take that break. Remember what I said. If you're going super speedy, you might get this done if you're lucky in 25, 30. Otherwise, we might take it all the way up to 45. Let's go plank reaches. 10 on each side. Opposite hand, opposite foot. Shoulders always stacked over those wrists. Oh goodness, find that balance. Nine, nine, ten, and ten. Now on those trans squats, whew, just ten total. Sit it down, drive it up. Use those hips. Six. Two more. Nine. And ten of those wood chops. Let's grab that med ball. Shoulders back. Pivot those hips. Feel that core. Whew. Three. Seven. Look in solid crew. Again, keep that body in motion. Let's switch sides. Other direction. Three, four, five, six, 
six, seven, couple more, eight, nine, here we go, ten of those push-ups, again going side to side with that ball, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew, love it, crew. In that Russian twist, ten on each side. I don't know about you guys, but I'm getting this nice light mist action right now, and it's gonna help cool me down, which is perfect because we got two more rounds after this. Then eight, nine, and ten. Back in those step ups, 10 on each leg. This should help those quads start coming solid. And if you can get those arms in there, nothing else, it's more fun, more a little bit aerobic capacity. Who doesn't like to add to their aerobic capacity? Now remember when we finish this up, we're going back up into 15 of everything. And that's your second to last round. And crew, we go to 15 dips right now. Whew. Gotta make sure my chair is solid. Going down for 15. Maybe you can extend those legs out or walk those feet in as you need to. Try to keep those shoulders back. Five more. Two, three, four, and five. Now we've got those reverse lunges, the high knees, 15 on each side. Again, squeeze that core, bring those shoulder blades down back. You guys are looking solid. Is it dead yet? Okay, so again, cousin with the computer with ants in it. If you have a solution, let me know. Okay, time to switch legs. All I know is I think the queen drowned last night. We're hoping. Whew. Looking solid. After the 15th on this leg, we go back down in that plank reach. 15 per side. And three. Here we go for two. Last one. Again, on this plank one, especially as you're getting tired, keep it slower and in control, placing that wrist below that shoulder as opposed to trying to speed it up. This way, we get more of that core to fire through. An option, go to your knees when and if you need it. Looking solid. We only have a few more to go. Oh goodness, don't let it get ya. Okay, now we're gonna do 16 of those trans squats. Because remember, I like even numbers. Whew. You guys are solid right now. I do not know why I'm sweating this much. So hopefully you guys are too. Okay. Just about four more. Two, three, the last one. We got those wood chops, six, 15 per side. Let's keep it here, core nice and tight. Now remember, if you feel this in that low back, nay nay, bring that belly button to the spine. Maybe you don't go up as high or as far over. Pivot with that heel. Two, three, four, and we're gonna switch sides. 15, go in that opposite direction. Looking solid. Eight. 
Here we go. Five more. Two. Three. Four. The last one. And now we got those 15 push-ups crew. Remember, trying to start on that opposite side this time. As you get low, pass the ball, get back into it. As always, go on those knees when you need it. Nine. Here's the ten. Five more. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. And fifteen. Now we got fifteen of those Russian twist crew. Woo! Shoulder blades back, chest proud, move those shoulders, and that's fine. Six. You guys are crushing this. Eight, nine, ten, and five more. We then go back to that chair, and then we got our final round. Twenty of everything after those step ups. Okay, group. Fifteen step ups per side. Up, up, down, down. Counting off that one leg. So that was one. Here we go. Woo. Now as you do this, make sure you're breathing, find that flow, and as always, if your step or chair is too much, take it on down to that march and just march it out, crew. After we've done 15 on each side, we start back at the shoulder dips for 20. Whew. Last four. Last three. Two more, two more. The last one each side. Let's get it. Whew. And crew, back up to shoulder dips for 20 reps. Let's get into it. Shoulders down back. Sit it back and drive it up. Especially because it's that last round. If you find those shoulders going forward, are you rounding that spine? Nay, nay, try and bring them back. Keep it tight. 17, 18, 19, one more, 20. Woo. Okay, 20 reverse lunges and those high knees per side. Use that core. I'm gonna say that every round. Continuing this is the last thing I have. Woo. Love it, crew. 13, 14, 15, 16. You know, doing 20 on one side does take a while. Woo, let's go ahead and switch it. 20 on this side. Lift that knee. Try not to crisscross if you can. You're getting a little wobbly. Just readjust and get right back into it. Last five, four, here's three, two, and one. Now we got that plank reach, 20 on each side. So again, adjust as you need to. Find the best flow you can, either on knees, toes, or somewhere in between. So I showed one of each of those. Remember this one, lots of focusing on placing wrists under shoulders, keeping that belly button in that spine so you're not popping your butt, but you're not dropping that back. Try and keep that arm and leg same height. Last five. Four. Three. 
two, and one. Okay, 20 trans squats. Whew, that was fun. Remember, try to sit back into those hips. Give me 45 degree angles. Whew. Halfway. Here we go. Four more. You guys got this. The last two. And now back to those wood chops. 20 on each side. Whew. If those shoulders are getting tired, give me your best effort. Still squeeze that core. Throw with that hip. Halfway, halfway on this side crew. Just aim this way. Only three more exercises after this. Six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. 20 on that side, 20 on that other side. Again, squeeze that glute as you toss that ball. Keep it up, keep it up. Here we go, halfway on this side crew, almost done. Last five, give me your best effort. One, two, three, four, last one, and five. Now I've got my side, or the med ball push ups. Going side to side with that med ball, 20 total. Again, toes or knees, find your flow. Whew. That took a little time second out through than that very first lap we did a 20. Okay, let's get in that Russian twist. 20 on each side. Whew. Crew, you guys are killing this. Seven, eight, nine. Keep that body going. Fifteen, five more each side. Nineteen, twenty, and twenty. Now twenty of those step ups per side, and then crew, you are technically done. Whew. I will give you that option of if you want a bonus round. For right now, let's get these step ups done. I'm at five and five. Quads are finally starting to go like, oh my goodness, all of those step ups. Woo. But, crew, we're coming up to the last five. So, let's take it home. Here's one. Let's go for two. 
Here we go, ready for three. Four. Two. The last one each leg, right here. Five. And five. Woo! Crew, you guys killed this right under 40 minutes. Holy Toledo. So, if you're so itching for more, the um, bonus round, it's on that whiteboard, but it's going to be alternating that V up, so opposite leg each time. Those bear steps we've done, and Superman's where you're laying on your belly, extending each on the minute, then on the 30, then on the minute. But I gotta go get ready for my day. So thank you guys for joining so much on a Monday. You guys never miss a Monday. If you have anything that you're wanting to see, just again, let me know. Otherwise, enjoy those days. And I will see you all tomorrow.